guys, welcome back to another Israel Fishing episode. Today we're out here at St. Louis Pond. We're after some channel cats. We are gonna be chasing some bass with the moving ADX today with my favorite crankbait I've been using this fall. Hopefully we can land one here. I haven't landed one in St. Louis using the ADX, but I have caught a bunch at Riverfront Park. So if you guys wanna see those videos, go ahead and check it down, check it out. The videos are gonna be in the description below. But if you like fishing videos and you're new to the channel, if you like bass fishing and cat fishing, make sure to subscribe so you can see more videos like this one today. So stay tuned guys, wish me luck. Right now I'm fishing the Movement ADX. I am at St. Louis Ponds. I think I'm in Pond 7, the mud pond. I'm fishing for some bass right now, but I also brought some uh, chicken hearts to try to catch a, uh, a channel cat. Try to catch my first channel cat today. Hopefully we can accomplish that. That would be lovely if I did get a channel cat today. See that? We just got slammed right here. Small skinny guy. He's a small guy though. He's so small. That was actually our first hit with the ADX at this mud pond. Huh. Ooh. Bird's nest. We're not gonna try too long for that guy. He's a tiny guy anyways. What I really want to catch is a big channel cat today. I have lost a channel cat here once, a couple weeks ago. I think it was just peeling and dragging and went underneath a, a log and I lost him. That's okay. We're gonna try to catch one today and hopefully we can accomplish that. I did bring chicken hearts like I said and it's a little windy so I apologize for that. As soon as I put my uh, other pole in the water. Right now I'm just throwing it around these logs trying to catch first bass because I want to catch fish. Haven't caught a fish in a while. Haven't been out fishing. I've been so busy with work and life and man I could really use a big old fish right now. Windy, perfect time to throw a crankbait, a chatterbait, any movement bait, especially in this muddy pond, which could uh, potentially catch a PB here. If you're lucky, Tony has missed so many big fish here. For me, this place has been poo poo, and I have not caught any decent fish, or there's times when I've been skunked, but I refuse to throw a chatterbait right now. Please don't get snagged. Let's keep on moving. Oh, I can't pass up all these logs. I just want to get to my catfishing spot, but I can't pass these logs up, man. There's gotta be tree, I mean fish underneath these logs. Alrighty, let's keep moving. We're almost there to our hunting spot. Look at all these nice logs right here. Prime bass fishing. Yeah, there's a possibility we can catch a bass today because I've already missed one on the crankbait. We just gotta keep trying and trying and trying. My bad. Alrighty, let's go over here. I think I might set up the chicken heart somewhere over here. Let's see. Right here is perfect. Oh, look, they already got some sticks for us. It's perfect. Alright, we're going to set up the chicken hearts right here. Put this pole right there. 
perfect, perfect. I can take my bag off. the chicken hard we're using. I'm using a chicken hard with some cherry jello for some flavor. There it is. Alrighty, let's catch ourselves a big catfish. Alrighty, there's a hole over there. There's a lot of pulping trees. I'm gonna cast over here, not too far out for our first cast. Right there, that's perfect. I'm gonna give the line a lot of slack. A lot of slack. Let's be real good. I want to be able to hear it. That's perfect. Alright, that's pull is set up. We'll be able to hear it if a fish picks it up. Can I keep moving? Bait right here, this looks like a good spot. All the way out there. Get that right here. All right, we got our rod set up. Put my backpack down. Make a couple more casts around here, try to catch a bass before I decide I want to switch baits because I haven't been catching any bass, any largemouth on this crankbait. Switch the old chatterbait and probably would have caught a fish by now. It's alright. It's okay. Whatever. Alrighty, well the ADX ain't getting any bites right now, so I'm gonna make the smart decision and just switch baits right now. Boom. It's the chatterbait we're gonna use. For some reason man, they love the chatterbait in this pond. Going this way. Fuck! It's my only goddamn shatter bait. Oh. Yeah. Oh, Betty. Woo! We would have never got this baggie's mother rod. Yeah. How's that hook? Uh, it actually didn't look like it got bent out. Awesome. Well, guys, we're doing pretty bad right now. I haven't even caught a fish yet. I did miss a bass right when I started fishing, and then after that, it just phew, went dead. I've been fishing all the pond seven so far from the back. We're almost back to where I started fishing for bass, but it's not looking too good. We're gonna keep trying. Right now it's about four o'clock. We started at 12, fish for another hour or two, and hope we catch something, because this is getting pretty bad. Pretty embarrassing. 
but I appreciate you guys sticking around. Let's just keep fishing. Hopefully we catch something. All right, guys. Well, we're almost at the end of our fishing session. Just gonna fish this front part real quick, and I have the cat pull out right now, aka my bass fishing rod. Just gonna try to catch a fish before I leave, cause damn, man, that's all I want is just a fish. Fish on guys, fish on. It's a massive fish. It's a big fish. Yes. 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 What is up? Oh my God, look at that. That was not a big fish, but that was a struggle to catch this guy all day. Oh my God, look how pale he is. He is freaking pale as heck, man. Wow, look at that mouth on the chatterbait. Wow, woo! It's a uh, let's get this guy out of here. Chatterbait out of his mouth. Boom, man! Nice little pounder right here, pound and a half, pound and a quarter. Check that out, boys. First fish of the day, right before I was like, oh man, I'm gonna call it quits. And I catch the first one on a chatterbait, which is pretty awesome. We're still trying for a catfish, but that's probably not gonna happen. Maybe we can catch one more bass. We're gonna keep trying. And if you guys like watching videos like this, make sure you hit that subscribe button. We're gonna keep trying to catch more bass. So stay tuned, guys. Let's let this guy go real quick. Oh man, thanks for the fight, little guy. I thought you were bigger, but it's all good. It's all good. That was epic, man. Let's try to catch another one. Well, guys, unfortunately, we have run out of time today. I was only able to catch one bass. I'm fishing St. Louis, pond number seven. I call it the mud pond. I was doing some cat fishing as well, using some chicken hearts mixed with some uh, sherry jello. Those didn't catch, get any bites or anything. But they're out here. Just need to look for them. Now, this is the, the shatter bait. I was using to catch that bass. It's a nice little pound and a half bass. It's a little torn up now. But it's been working. Got one bass at least. But hopefully next time we'll do better. Maybe next time we'll be out here fishing for some stock trout. We did stock the trout in St. Louis. But I didn't want to go out for trout today. I just want to keep fishing for bass and uh, can't fish anymore. It's too late. It starts to get too cold. If you want to see more videos like this, make sure to like and subscribe. Oh, and let me know what your uh, favorite catfish bait to use right now is because I need some help. Maybe I can need to find a better bait to use. I was using chicken hearts, maybe. Uh, you guys know a better recipe. So, yeah. I'll catch you guys on the next episode. Like I said, like and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Leave a comment down below what you guys want to see next. I'll catch you guys next time.